maths online class today we are going to revise the chapter statistics and probability already ning in the chapter paathirpinga first one range is equal to l minus s that means l minus s means largest value minus smallest value for a data group paanga given data paathina 2 5 20 ஒரு <laughs> இந்த மைனஸ் எஸ் லெஃப்ட் சைடு ஷிஃப்ட் பண்ணா பிளஸ் எஸ் லார்ஜ் எல் இன் தி சேம் பிளேஸ் ரேஞ்ச் ரைட் சைடு ஷிஃப்ட் பண்ணா மைனஸ் சோ ஸ்மாலஸ்ட் வேல்யூ இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு லார்ஜஸ்ட் வேல்யூ மைனஸ் ரேஞ்ச் இன் கேஸ் லார்ஜஸ்ட் வேல்யூ ஃபைண்ட் அவுட் பண்ண சொன்னாங்க அப்படினா ரேஞ்ச் அண்ட் ஸ்மாலஸ்ட் வேல்யூ கொடுத்து லார்ஜஸ்ட் வேல்யூ வேணும் அப்படினா சோ எல் இன் தி சேம் பிளேஸ் மைனஸ் எஸ் ஷிஃப்ட் டு லெஃப்ட் சைடு லெஃப்ட் ஹேண்ட் சைடு பிளஸ் எஸ் சோ ரேஞ்ச் பிளஸ் எஸ் இத பேஸ் பண்ணி ஈஸியா ஃபைண்ட் அவுட் பண்ணலாம் இது டூ மார்க்ஸ்ல வரும் நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் யூ நோ தி கான்செப்ட் एवरेज தட் மீன்ஸ் ஃபார் எக்ஸாம்பிள் ஃபைண்ட் தி एवरेज ஆஃப் 6 ஸ்டூடண்ட்ஸ் அப்படினு சொல்லிட்டு அவங்களோட ஹைட் கொடுத்திருக்காங்கனா அந்த 6 ஸ்டூடண்ட்ஸ்ோட ஹைட் x பார் னு சொல்லுவோம் एवरेज ऐड பண்ணிட்டு அது என்ன செய்யணும்னா the 6 ஸ்டூடண்ட்ஸ் அப்படினா 6 ஆல டிவைட் பண்ணோம் சோ sum of all observations divided by total number of observations that is x bar x bar என்ன சொல்றோம் arithmetic mean right okay next one standard deviation இதுல two type இருக்கு first one ungrouped data next one grouped data ungrouped data அத பாத்தீங்கன்னா 2 4 5 methods இருக்கு first one பாத்தீங்கன்னா direct method very very simple method for a form of the sigma is equal to root of summation x squared by n minus summation x by n the whole square that is direct method in the method pathina given data smallest value are the easier id apply pannala that means 2 5 10 15 35 35 idhukku nama direct method apply pannala sorry 35 la 25 or 25 below 20 ku la irundha easier irukum right next one mean method that is sigma is equal to root of summation d square divided by n here d is equal to x minus x bar x bar means average so sigma is equal to root of summation d square by n next one assumed mean method very very simple then sigma is equal to root of summation d square by n minus summation d by n the whole square that is the formula so is a d here d is equal to x minus a a means assumed mean so assumed mean na for example 2 4 5 data kuduthirukanga appadina idella nam endha data vana la eduthukalam assumed mean ava mean assumed mean for example a is equal to 10 or a is equal to 15 or a is equal to 35 anyone so standard deviation sigma is equal to root of summation d square by n minus summation d by n the whole square that is assumed mean method next one step deviation method then sigma is equal to square root of summation d squared by n minus summation d by n the whole square into c so idu as usual na inge c pathina c means common divisor for example 5 10 15 என்ன சார் group sorry ungrouped na inda method la kuduthirupanga grouped appadina x and f frequency kuduthirupanga x and f for example 
then x yes then 2 3 5 7 then 10 15 20 35 இந்த மாதிரி கொடுத்திருந்தாங்க குரூப்டு டேட்டா ரைட் தென் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஒன் மீன் மெத்தட் மீன் மெத்தட் மீன்ஸ் சிக்மா இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு ரூட் ஆஃப் மீன்ஸ் சமேஷன் எஃப் டி ஸ்கொயர் டிவைட் பை என் ரைட் ஹியர் டி இஸ் ஈக்குவல் டு எக்ஸ் மைனஸ் எக்ஸ் பவர் நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் அஷ்யூம்டு மீன் மெத்தட் சேம் ஃபார்ம்லா ரூட் ஆஃப் சமேஷன் எஃப் டி ஸ்கொயர் டிவைட் பை சமேஷன் f minus summation f d by then summation f the whole square that is the formula summation f ன்னு எழுதலாம் r capital n ன்னு கொடுக்கலாம் r capital n summation f d square by n minus sorry summation f d square by n minus summation f d by n the whole square right then step deviation method same formula summation f d square by n minus summation f d square sorry f d divided by n the whole square into c that is the step deviation method formula right the variance and standard deviation rendu kuda difference enna sir appadina standard deviation ah sigma is equal to square root of formula irukum variance appadina ketaanga variance Variance is equal to sigma squared is equal to summation d squared by n minus summation f d sorry summation d by n the whole squared. It is another variance squared or no? Very sigma squared or the variance sigma on the standard deviation. Right. Next one example eight point seven. Model for sum. இதில் ஸ்டெப் டிவியேஷன் மெத்தட் அப்ளை பண்ணுறேன் இந்த சம்மில் இந்த சம் அப்ளை பண்ணோம்னா இந்த நீங்கள் இந்த மெத்தடில் எந்த மெத்தட் அப்ளை பண்ணாலும் ஆன்சர் சேமாக தான் வரும் ரைட் த அமௌண்ட் த கேன் த கேன் சில்ட்ரன் ஹேவ் ஸ்பெண்ட் ஃபார் பர்ச்சேசிங் சம் இ டபுள் சின் ஒன் டே ட்ரிப் ஆஃப் அ ஸ்கூல் ஆர் ஃபைவ் கமா டென் கமா ஃபிஃப்டீன் கமா டுவெண்ட்டி கமா டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபைவ் கமா தேர்ட்டி கமா தேர்ட்டி ஃபைவ் கமா ஃபார்ட்டி யூசிங் step deviation method find the standard deviation of the amount they have spent yes using step deviation method so inga mention mari sonnadala nama step deviation method da apply pannom in case find the using step deviation method in the line illama find the standard deviation of the amount they have spent inda me inda question matum irundha nama endha method la apply pannikala right then assume we mean first one but you know assume we mean a then n is equal to find out formula formula sigma is equal to standard deviation sigma is equal to root of summation d squared by n minus summation d by n the whole square into c that is the formula right first one given x 5 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 சோ நம்ம ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஒன் d is equal to x minus a by c இதல ஃபர்ஸ்ட் நம்பர் ஆஃப் டேட்டாஸ் கவுண்ட் பண்ணோம் தென் 2 4 6 8 கேர் n is equal to 8 தட் இஸ் ஈவன் நம்பர் n is equal to 8 is the even number so in case odd number அதான் நோ ப்ராப்ளம் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் 3 3 டிவைட் பை மிட் வேல்யூ அட் போயிட்டே இருக்கலாம் பட் இங்க 8 இருக்குறதுனால இங்கே பார்த்தீங்கன்னா ஒன் டூ த்ரீ ஃபோர் நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் டூ த்ரீ ஃபோர் இதில் இந்த இடத்துல எடுக்கணும் ஸோ இதில் மோஸ்ட்லி டுவெண்ட்டி ஃபைவ் எடுக்க வேணாம் டுவெண்ட்டி எடுக்கணும் ஏன்னா இங்கே எடுக்கும்போது மைனஸில் சமேசன் டி மைனஸில் வரத்துக்கு சான்சஸ் இருக்கு ரைட் தென் கேர் ஏ இஸ் ஈக்வல் டு டுவெண்ட்டி கேர் ஏ இஸ் ஈக்வல் டு டுவெண்ட்டி தென் டி இஸ் ஈக்வல் டு எக்ஸ் மைனஸ் ஏ பை சி ஸோ ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஒன் ஃபைவ் மைனஸ் 5 minus 20 divided by 5. Here n is sorry, c is equal to 5. C is the common divisor. So 5, sorry, 10 minus 5, 5. 15 minus 5, 10, 5. 20 minus 15, 5. 25 minus 20, 5. So the common divisor is equal to 5. So here c, c is equal to 5. Right. First one, 
d is equal to x minus a by c. So 5 minus 20 divided by 5, then minus 15 divided by 5, 1 5 is 5, 3 by is 15. So minus 3. Next one, d is equal to x minus a, 10 minus a, 20 divided by c is equal to 5. Then minus 10 divided by 5. 1 5 is 5, 2 5 is 10. So minus 2. The next one, 15 minus 15 minus 15 minus 20 divided by 5 is equal to minus 5 divided by 5. We get minus 1. Minus 1. Right. Sorry. Minus 1. Right. Next one, 20 minus 1d is equal to 20 minus 20 divided by 5 is equal to 0. Then 20 minus 20, 0 divided by 5, 0. Then 0. Next one, d is equal to 25 minus 20 divided by 5 is equal to 25 minus 5, 25. 5 by 5 is equal to 1. Then 1. Next one, d is equal to 30 minus 20 divided by 5. 5 is equal to 10 divided by 5 is equal to 2. Then next one, sorry, 2. Then 35, d is equal to 35 minus 20 divided by 5 is equal to 15 divided by 5. 1 5 is 5, 3 5 is 15. d is equal to 3. Next one, d is equal to 40 divided by 20 divided by, sorry, 40 minus 20 divided by 5 is equal to 20 divided by 5, 1 5 is 5, 4 by 20, then 4, then d square, minus 3 the over square, plus 9, minus 2 the over square, plus 4, then plus 1, 0, 1, 2 square, 4, 3 square, 9, 4 square, 16, then 4 plus 3, that is, summation d is equal to 4 plus 3, 7, 7 plus 2, 9, 9 plus 1, 10, 10 minus 1, 9, 9 minus 2, 7, 7 minus 3, 4. Therefore, summation d is equal to 4. Next one, summation d square is equal to 9 plus 4, 13, 13 plus 1, 14, 14 plus 1, 15, 15 plus 5, sorry, 4, 19, 19 plus 9, 28, 28 plus 6, 34, 3, then 4, 44. Therefore, summation d squared is equal to 44. We know the formula of standard deviation. Sigma is equal to root of summation d squared by n minus summation d by n the whole square into c. Standard deviation. Sigma is equal to root of summation d squared by n minus summation d by n the whole square into c. Then root of summation d square 44. Then 44 divided by n is equal to 8. 44 divided by 8 minus summation d by n. Then 4 divided by 8. 4 divided by 8 the whole square into 5. Right. Then root of 2 fourths are 8. 11 fourths are 44. Then root of 11 divided by 2. Minus 1 divided by 2 the whole square. 2 4 are 8. 1 4 is 4. Into 5. Then root of 11 divided by 2. 5.5. 5. Then 5 2 are 10. Remainder 1. Point 0. 5 2 are 10. Minus 1 divided by 4. Into 5. Then root of 5.5. 5. Minus 1 divided by 4 is equal to 0 0.024 0. sir 8 remainder 2 25 or sir 20 then remainder 0 then minus 0 0.25 into 5 then root of 5.5 minus 0 0.25 then 0 then 4 10 minus 5 5 4 minus 2 2 
then 4.25 root of 4.25 into 5. The end method is for end method is for the root of 1 long division method, another one flex table. Flex table is for 2.29 or 1 into 5. Then 9 5 is 45, remainder 4. Then 5 to 10, 10 plus 4, 14, remainder 1. 5 to 10, 10 plus 1, 11. 2 digit in 11, 11.45. Therefore, sigma is equal to approximately 11.45. So, next topic, coefficient of variation. Okay, coefficient of variation. CV is equal to sigma divided by x bar into 100. So, CV means coefficient of variation. If sigma is 11.45, then x bar find up from x bar is equal to all data are add from x to the value at x to the value at 5, 5, 10, 15, 20, 35, 30, 30, 25, 30, 35, up to 40 are add from it. Then total 8 and divide from now. So we are find out from x bar find out from it. Last one, the formula apply for no. So 11.45 divided by x bar order value apply for no. Into 100 for no. CV order value is here get it wrong. That is wipes and up variation. Next one, example 8.10. Find the mean and the variance of the first n natural numbers. Mean and the variance of the first n natural numbers. We know the formula sum of the first n natural numbers. That means 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc. plus n is equal to n into n plus 1 divided by 2. Then the sum of the squares of first n natural numbers 1 square plus 2 square plus 3 square plus etc. plus n squared is equal to n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 6. In the two formulas, apply it for right? Then mean x bar is equal to mean x bar is equal to summation x divided by n that means 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus etc plus n divided by n is equal to n into n plus 1 divided by 2 into n n n cancel therefore x bar is equal to n plus 1 divided by 2 therefore mean x bar is equal to n plus 1 divided by 2 that is mean first one find out for the next one variance we know the formula sigma squared variance sigma squared is equal to summation x squared by n minus summation x by n the whole squared so Summation x by n equal to n plus 1 by 2 apply to the next thing is summation x squared by n then summation x squared by n is equal to 1 square plus 2 square plus 3 square plus etc plus n square divided by n divided by n is equal to n into n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 6 into n, n n cancel, then n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 6, right. Now applying the value of summation x squared by n and the summation x by n in the formula, sigma squared is equal to n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 6. That is summation x squared by n minus summation x by n is equal to n plus 1 divided by 2 the whole square. So n plus 1 into 2n plus 1 divided by 2 into 3. 6 is equal to 2 into 3 minus n plus 1 divided by 2 the whole square. We are taking n plus 1 divided by 2 as common then n plus 1 divided by 2 into 2n plus 1 divided by 3 minus n plus 1 divided by 2 you know, 2 times you know, one time we will add that next one n plus 1 divided by 2 
into here using cross multiplication in the bracket. When I use one glass, then remove one glass. Then 2 into 2 into 2n plus 1. So 4n plus 2. 2 into 2n, 4n plus 2 into 1, 2 minus <coughs> 3n minus 3. Minus 3 plus minus. So minus 3 divided by 3 to the 6. Right. Then n plus 1 divided by 2 into 4n minus 3n, 1n. Then plus 2 minus 3 we get minus 1 divided by 6. Then n plus 1 into n minus 1 divided by 12. Here you see the formula a, minus, a plus b into a minus b. We know the formula a plus b into a minus b is equal to a square minus b square. So n square minus 1 divided by 12. Therefore, variance sigma squared is equal to n squared minus 1 divided by 12. This is the formula apply for the sum of the standard deviation. Sorry, the standard deviation of first n natural numbers. The standard deviation, the standard deviation of first n natural numbers is equal to root of n squared minus 1 divided by 12. Root of n squared minus 1 divided by 12. That is the formula. In the formula based on the two more questions are exercise learn. Is here follow up on the Right. Next one C V so much C V learn. C V is equal to sigma by x bar into 100. Here we C V equal to x bar root to sigma find out for solving. So sigma find out for solving. Sigma is equal to C V in the same place into x bar into x bar or something like that. Divided by 100. That is sigma find out for solving. Same concept. X bar find out for long, right? X bar left side do, C V right side shift for long, then X bar is equal to, then sigma divided by C V into 100. There are two more so wrong. C V main on a main find out for long, which, which one is more consistent in Gapa. For example, one of the XS or some people temperature of city A and the temperature of city B put the pump, and like which, which one is more consistent in question get upon. Other, either we base on the Find out for number you want. CV find out for you want compulsory. Right. Next one. Probability. Probability means, for example, for a even. That is, in the Himala, Varo, Abdi Nether Pagra, Abdi Ilana, Varam Oda Pola. You don't say under the word random experimental solo. For example, the kind task from wrong, Kete Kama, Kaili. Festival la, that is style la, right? Is that enough? Solve one possible outcomes and solve one, right? Then first one, sample space. The set of all possible outcome is outcome of random experiment is called a sample space. Is every denote for one, yes. Bring it out, denote for one, denote for one. Next event that we have done is the fifth style. This is one event, style and one event. This is what is the P of a and the probability of A is equal to the question and I get upon the what is the probability of one head of the now n of A is equal to one or head there so n of A is equal to one then n of A by n of S is equal to one divided by two to be so long right first one a coin is tossed twice we get Head, 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 tail, tail, head, tail, tail. So, four events carry on, right? That is, sample space S is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4 events carry on. So, N of S is equal to 4. This is three kinds of dinner. Eight events carry on. This is every sort of average plan. First, head, head, two kinds of events are wrong. Then, sample space S, head, tail, Tail, head, tail, tail. Same. Head, 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 tail, tail, head, tail, tail. So first roller, head, tail, head, tail. Second roller, tail, head, tail, head. This is a sorted form. So three times now, sample space, eight, one, 
இதுல ரிப்பீட்டிங் இருக்காது ரிப்பீட்டட் டர்ம்ஸ் இருக்கவே இருக்காது ஈவென்ட் இருக்கவே இருக்காது ரைட் நெக்ஸ்ட் ஒன் ஏ டை இஸ் ரோல்ட் ஒன்ஸ் வி கெட் தி சம் ஸ்பேஸ் s is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 இன் கேஸ் ஏ டை இஸ் ரோல்ட் ட்வைஸ் s is equal to 6 into 6 here enough s is equal to 6 two kinds of s is enough s is equal to 6 into 6 is equal to 30 6 already sample space from pathula right next one ela easy identify pandrathu easy kekkanga enna error yet enna s is equal to 36 ila double it nu solluvanga double it appadina same numbers irukum for example 1,1 then 2,2 3,3 going on 6,6 varaiy varum right next one playing cards la pathina total number of cards is equal to 52 in the two colors are come first one padina red second one black in the four flowers are come one four flowers flower parting diamond spad there is a order in your book la adha neenga refer panninga right each flower 13 cards are go so four tens are 52 in the red king padina 2 irku black king 2 so total of 4 kings irukum q n also 4 as 4 4 cards irukum right right next one exercise 8.3 la sixth sum idu konjam ona tough a irukum a bag contains 12 blue balls and x red balls if one ball is thrown at random what is first one what is the probability that it will be a red ball second subdivision If eight more red balls are put in the bag, and if the probability of drawing a red ball will be the twice the of the probability in one, five, then find x. So twelve first starting the twelve blue balls and the x red balls are given. Other base for me first one for the probability find it for draw. That is the number n of s. Sorry, s one is wrong. N of n of s one is equal to 12 blue balls and x red balls so 12 plus x then p of a is equal to that means that a be the even of getting a red ball so p of a is equal to n of a by n of yes here n of a is equal to here n of a is equal to x red ball so x divided by 12 plus x right then n of s2 mean already n of s one 12 plus x balls are there if eight more red balls are put in the bag so x plus 12 plus 8 is equal to x plus 20 therefore n of s2 is equal to x plus 20 that will be the even of getting a getting a red ball probability of trying a red ball will be the twice first second one red ball now என்ன செஞ்சிருவானே 8 more red balls will add பண்ணனால b ன்னு எடுத்துறேன் நான் b is equal to x plus 8 then p of b is equal to n of b divided by n of s then x plus 8 divided by x plus 20 x plus 20 that is p of b then condition and if the probability of drawing a red ball will be the Twice the dot the probability in one. That means p of b second order probability, first order probability will be twice. Or that is two into p of a. Then p of b x plus a divided by x plus twenty. Then two into p of a x divided by twelve plus x. Then x plus a divided by x plus twenty. Is equal to 2x divided by 12 plus x. Then x plus 8 into x plus 12. 12 plus x into left hand side. So x plus 8 into x plus 12. And x plus 20 is equal to right hand side. Then 2x into x plus 20. Then x into x, x square. Then x into 12, 12x plus 8 into x, 8x. Plus 12 x r 96 is equal to then 2 x square plus 
40x 2x into x 2x square m into 2x into 20 40x then 0 sorry x square plus 20x plus 90 6 is equal to 2x square plus 40x then 0 is equal to x square plus 20x plus 96 shift to right hand side then 2x square minus x square plus 40x then minus 20x minus 96 then x square plus 20x minus 96 is equal to 0 x square plus 20x minus 96 is equal to 0 that is the quadratic equation here factorizing the quadratic equation then product of the two factors are minus 96 sum is 20 then find out the factors then each side in the big one of the will not 2 4 2 are 8 remainder 1 16 8 2 are 16 then 2 2 2 are 4 4 2 are 8 then 2 12 2 6 then 2 3 then 3 1 so 2 8 2 2 are 4 4 2 are 8 8 2 are 16 16 2 are 16 2 are 32 32 2 are sorry into 3 96 on the round right we will easy add the 5 under the pin 2 2 are 4 4 2 are 8 8 3 are 24 then 8 in 8 3 are 24 8 to 4 is here 24 into then 2 2 are 4 4 2 are 8 8 into 3 24 then 2 into 2 4 then 24 into 4 minus 4 plus into minus minus 24 into 4 96 then 24 minus 4 20 divided by x divided by x then x plus 24 into x minus 4 is equal to 0 then x plus 24 is equal to 0 comma x minus 4 is equal to 0 x is equal to minus 24 comma x is equal to 4 <coughs> x cannot be negative so therefore the value of x is equal to 4 first order probability find out for now you know question is written now what is the probability that will be a red bar so p of a is equal to x divided by 12 plus x so 4 divided by 4 plus 12 is equal to 4 divided by 16 1 4 is 4 4 4 is 16 1 divided by 4 that's all right next one addition theorem of probability if a and b are two events the events a and b are not the mutually exclusive events then p of a union b is equal to p of a plus p of b minus p of a into 6 and b a and b are not a mutually a in intersection b not is equal to empty set the events a and b have at least one common event right <coughs> then a and b are mutually exclusive events that means p of a plus p of b here a intersection b is equal to empty set that is the event a and b the common events right next one the events a comma b and c are not the mutually exclusive events then p of a union b union c is equal to p of a plus p of b plus p of c minus p of a into section b minus p of b into section c minus p of a into section c plus p of a into section b into section c in case a and b a comma b and c are mutually exclusive then p of a union b union c is equal to p of a plus p of b plus p of c that's all next one p of a intersection b bar that means only 
a proud a only a then p of a minus p of a intersection b and p of a bar intersection b that means p of a sorry b only is equal to p of b minus p of a intersection b इन्द्र को ना डिफरेंस पता है ना ये बार अंदर ना ये ऐड करो ये ये बार अंदर ना ना बी ऐड करो ना दस साल ये इंटरसेक्शन भी इन्द्र के में कॉमन राइट नेक्स्ट वन इधर इन्द्र फॉर्म वाले इनका सर अप्लाई करना वेरी सिंपल इसी आना तो क्वेश्चन है तो इप्पर आर अपडिंग रे वेड अंदर फॉर्म फॉर एग्जांपल ये � डबलेट आ रहे हैं टोटल सम ऑफ फोर अब इन कहते हैं ना डबलेट आ टोटल सम ऑफ फोर अब इन रे आ इन रे वेड अंदर के इधर इधर तले इधर फॉर्म का अप्लाई करना है राइट एक्साम्पल एट पॉइंट टू नाइन टू टाइम्स आ रोल्ड टुकड़ा फाइंड द प्रॉब्लम या कहते हैं ये डबलेट आ सम फेसेस एस फोर so 2 times are rolled together so n of s is equal to 36 sum of space s is equal to 1 comma 1 1 comma 2 1 comma 3 up to 6 comma 6 here n of s is equal to 36 <coughs> getting a doublet r a sum of faces as 4 so r is divided on the other the form of a by one so p of a union b right first even let a be the event of getting a doublet so a is equal to doublet that means 1 comma 1 2 comma 2 3 comma 3 4 comma 4 5 comma 5 6 comma 6 so 1 comma 1 2 comma 2 3 comma 3 then 4 comma 4 then 5 comma 5 then 6 comma 6 here n of a is equal to 6 then p of a is equal to n of a divided by n of s then 6 divided by 36 right next one sum faces as 4 let d be the event of getting sum faces as 4 so b is equal to so sum faces uh, in the faces add from 4 or no so 1 to 1 plus 1 2 not possible give 1 plus 2 3 impossible then 1 comma 3 first even 1 comma 3 next one <coughs> 2 comma 2 then then 2 plus 2 4 next one 3 comma 1 3 comma 1 that's all next 4 plus 1 5 1 wrong right here n of b is equal to 3 then p of b is equal to n of b divided by n of s then 3 divided by 36 here a and b are not a mutually exclusive event because the common event is 2 comma 2 therefore a intersection b is equal to 2 comma 2 then n of a intersection b is equal to 1 then p of a intersection b is equal to n of a into section b by n of s 1 divided by 36 by addition theorem p of a union b is equal to p of a plus p of b minus p of a into section b p of a is equal to 6 divided by 36 plus p of a is equal to 3 divided by 36 minus 1 divided by 36 then taking 36 as common then 6 plus 3 minus 1 is equal to 9 minus 1 8 divided by 36 2 fourths are 8 9 fourths are 36 then 2 divided by 9 therefore p of a union b is equal to 2 divided by 9 therefore the probability of getting a doublet are a sum of faces as 4 is equal to 2 divided by 9 that's all Thank you.